We are a week from St. Patrick's Day, but the city of Henderson is already getting into the green spirit with a St. Patrick's Day festival that's kicking off right now. That's right, and our Paulina Butska is live at the festival, keeping an eye on the food and the wind, Paulina. Hey Abel, hey Trisha. So like Gina mentioned, we have seen a lot of that wind come through today. We've even seen a couple of showers, but here at Sin City Munchies, uh, owner Preston and his wife Shannon have taken some uh, precautions to make sure that if you're coming down here to get a funnel cake, you will enjoy yourself. The hustle and bustle of setting up a weekend long St. Patrick's Day Festival greeted Henderson residents on Friday. But it was all eyes on the sky as dark clouds and heavy winds also made an appearance. Saw the wind advisory that mm -hmm. has been posted. So as, as a precaution, just to make sure nothing takes off or flies, we have got concrete posts that we add and we strap them to the tent itself so that they don't take off on us. Sin City Munchies owner Preston Apostoli says in their 20 years doing this pop-up shop, he and his wife have perfected the art of staying safe. Our greatest fear right now is if it rains with a fryer on, if the water hits the, the fryer, it starts to e explode like popcorn and somebody can get burned. Other than that, we don't really have a lot of worries about this. City officials like Madeline Skeins with the city of Henderson say the winds are concerning, but she has confidence nothing will spoil the festivities. Our team is so prepared and ready for all kind of weather inclements that we are good to go. No festival would be complete without rides, which Skeins says will also be operational all weekend. You know, the rides are good to go. The um, carnival company will determine if it's too windy, if the rides can't go, but a lot of them are low level and should not be affected by the winds today. All right, so what can you expect if you come down to the festival this weekend? Well, Preston is uh, making sure that we've got a funnel cake that we're going to be trying in a moment. You can get fried Twinkies, fried Oreos, food, rides, uh, delicious drinks, of course, out here. And I mean, look at this. Tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. also come down here for the St. Patrick's Day Parade that's happening at 10 a.m. in Henderson. Reporting live, I'm Paulina Butska. Guys, back to you in the studio, but I'm going to... We'll start eating away. Bye. Oh, we are so jealous. That Paulina, looks so good. Stop it. I, yeah. my, my mouth is literally watering, <laughs> Trisha. We got to get out there. It looks like so much fun, oh. and we have some of the best places to celebrate St. Patrick's Day across our valley. All you have to do is head on over to our website at ktmv.com slash St. Patrick's Day 2023.